It's never easy being at the top, but the West Superior baseball team is embracing that target on their backs as they get set for the WIAA State Baseball Tournament, which kicks off tomorrow morning. Playing in the Division II semifinal game against Anigo this Wednesday night, Joe Rukamp's top ranked Phantoms are back at state for the first time since 2010. The senior laden team rolls into state on an 18 game winning streak, having only given up four runs all postseason long. West Superior knows they'll get everyone's best shot, but they're not heading to Fox City Stadium for the scenic tour. They're there to win two games. Goal number one all year was to win the conference. Goal number two was to win a state championship. And I, that's kind of been our goals in the program year in, year out. That really hasn't changed. So I think these guys are ready to get after it and they're anxious for the opportunity. They understand it's a two game thing. We're ready to get after it. It's something we've dreamed of doing, like not even just this year, coming into high school. Like that's the main goal is to get to state. And to actually be able to like accomplish this and hopefully go in and win state, it's unbelievable. Meanwhile, in Division One, Green Bay Preble makes her fourth straight state appearance as they take on Burlington in the quarterfinals tomorrow at 8 a.m. Preble's gotten a taste of the semifinals twice in their last three trips, but Andy Cunard's group is hungry to claim their first state title. And right now, the Hornets are firing on all cylinders, and they have all the tournament experience they will need to get the job done. Well, I think we have. A number of guys that can do different things, and I think we can plug guys into different roles. Um, we can maneuver guys around, and I, and I think that we've come to expect that the guys that go in are going to do their job, know what's expected of them, and just play within themselves and do the things that we need to do to be successful. I think having experience on the bench and throughout the field is very important. I think we just have a good chance at bringing home a gold ball this year.